With this video, I'm going to show you how to view a SAS data set in Excel. Uh, I put the code up on uh, my Google Drive in a public area so you can download the code. You need to copy the code into your auto call library and you also have to set options command Mac so command macros can be executed. I'm using 64-bit SAS and 64-bit Office. You may need to change some things in the program if you're mixing bitness. In, in fact, if you have 64-bit SAS and 32-bit Excel, you're probably going to have to use the PC file server, which is also usually in your uh, just set in your SAS already, or you can download the PC file server from SAS. It's a free add-on. Uh, you also will probably have to tell it where your Excel is uh, in one of the macros that you'll, you'll download. Uh, for example, I'm creating a data set called class here, which is just the mails from sashelp.class. If I highlight CLASS and type XLSH on the command line, It'll open up the, uh, the data set I created in Excel, and you can manipulate it in Excel and save it any place you want, want to save it. Um, you can also put, instead of typing XLSH on the command li line, you can put, put it on a function key where, where you would highlight uh, CLASS and hit a function key. I actually have it on my mouse, so I have a five button mouse uh, and it has like 20 actions on the mouse. Uh, so if I hit the uh, left side button after highlighting it, it'll open up the SAS data set in Excel. Uh, that's, that's about it. I hope you find this useful. Thank you.